For the last four years, I've been in sales and I've been selling expensive shit and making a ton of money. What if I told you that you can do it too and you can change your life with the skill sets that I'm about to give you right now? Now, after this video, and when I give you some fucking sauce, you're gonna apply this to your life, to your person, and to your business. Now, I've been in sales since 2021, and I've made a shit ton of money. I've also coached, trained, developed over 3,000 people to do the exact same stuff. I started in sales because of COVID wiped me off the board. Now, before I give you some sauce, I'm gonna give you a couple of the guys that we have that are far too young to make this type of money, but this is what they do. I have Dan Smith, 20 years of age, making over 20,000 every single month. Ismail, 17 years of age, can barely fucking drive, making over 25,000 every single month. I have people like Christian Jack, who is now coaching and leading teams. When I met him, he was the worst person on a team. He now makes over 50,000 every single month. The first lesson I'm gonna give you that ultimately allowed me to change my life, make me a multi-millionaire, and actually coach all of these people is objection handling is key. It is the single biggest skill that has allowed all of my guys to change their motherfucking life. So, first one, Skippy, is your objections. There's five big objections. Think about it, partner, and money, fear, logistics. The first two are actually smoke screens, which aren't actually objections. Once it hits money, it's gonna go money, fear, or money, logistics. Once it hit logistics, it's pretty easy. That's like the cat ran away with the fucking milk. The dog get my homework. My wife has the car, bullshit like this. The last one, which is the most important one, which is fear. And there's not a person on this earth on this green sun that can coach you like the billy goat. So once it hits fear, it's gonna be me, you, yesterday, and tomorrow. Once you learn how to overcome objections, you are the most in-demand salesperson in the motherfucking market. You are the person that cuts your motherfucking check. You are the person that every single business owner wants because you get deals done, you make a ton of money, and you are someone that they can depend on to bring in a tremendous amount of revenue for everyone else and build with you. So again, think about it, partner, money, money gets split into money fear or money logistics. Once it comes to logistics, it's pretty simple. Once it comes to fear, you gotta figure out is it me, you, yesterday, tomorrow. The second lesson that I wanna give you is what I call my three C's. I built this out over four years ago because I looked at the people that were in the market what did they have that the people that weren't successful in the market had? And this is what it is. Confidence, certainty, conviction. Number one, you have to be confident in yourself. You have to live by the code. You have to do the work. Certainty, which is massively important. You gotta have certainty in who you are. You gotta have certainty in your skill set. You gotta have certainty in your offer and what you present. There is nothing more upsetting as a salesperson to sell something that they truly do not believe in. Know what you sell and know that it absolutely executes on what it is that you're offering to your prospects, to your leads, to everyone else that you come in contact with. The last thing is conviction. Conviction is the biggest skill that I have felt in the treaties. Conviction is everything from how you walk into a room, how you walk into a space, how you walk onto your calls, how you walk into your meetings, how you walk into any interaction. It's how you carry yourself. It's the certainty that you have in how you look, how you act, how you behave, how people perceive you. You gotta have certainty in everything that you do when you open up this bad boy in your motherfucking face. The third one is the results. I call it the three R's. The three R's are fundamentally gonna change your life. The three R's are very fucking simple. It's your results, it's your reputation, and the third thing is your relationship. But the three R's are fundamentally based on the first 15K is you're gonna be your results, 15 to 25, 30K is gonna be based on your reputation. And then the last thing, which will take you to the fucking moon, if you got the cojones to go for it, is your relationships, which is your partnerships, which is equity deals, which is splits in terms of profit share and everything else like that. Maybe overrides in a company or a team or everything else. The first thing is your results. Most of you motherfucking idiots out there, all that you wanna do is you wanna talk about stuff that you've never done. You wanna talk about stuff that you've never did. You wanna talk about stuff that someone else has went and got and done. That's never gonna get you there. So your results is the first stuff that you gotta figure out. That comes in your skill set. That comes in putting the ball in the back of the net. That comes in being excellent at what it is that you want the market to know you for. It's gonna be based on not fucking crumbling when you get a no on the end of your call and cry like a little baby. Knowing how to 
push the conversation forward, know how to close deals out. All of my guys pretty much are number one in all of the companies. Why? Because I coach them like I'm coaching you right now. The second thing is your reputation. This is what people know of you. This is what people know about you. When you start to do well, you start to post well, and you start to build your results, people gravitate towards you, I would say. And what that ultimately means is that people start to talk about you. They start to talk about you to other people. They start to talk about you to their friends, to their colleagues, to their business owners, to their sales manager, and everyone else in between. This is a great place that you guys want to get to. It normally happens from 15 to about 25, 30,000 every single month. Why? Because now you're trustworthy in the market. Now people know that you get shit done. Now people know that you are consistent in the results every single month. And it normally takes anywhere from three to nine months to get yourself into that position. The third R is very fucking simple. This will take you to the motherfucking moon. It is your relationship. This is when people know that you get a result. People build off your reputation so they know what they're getting themselves in for. This is when people want to come and build relationships with you. So this is when you get equity shares, you get profit overrides, you get commission percentages based on the team's performance. This is when people come to you. This is all based on your results, on your reputation, and being in the game for a good amount of time. See, the problem that a lot of people have is they want to go too fast, too soon, too quick, and they build up on a house of cards. This is when you get a bad name in the market because you build off shitty solid foundations. People don't want to be in business with people that are shakeable. In order to be sustainable in the market, in order to have consistent income, in order to take care of your family, your friends, your future, your cars, your watches, like you see with me, it's like everything is built off the three R's. First, in 2021, I had to build my results. That took me six months. Then people started to know about me. And after a while, the reputation came out. When I built the business in 2022, the objection box, the first four months of business, we'd build over a million dollars. We didn't do that because we were still in the results space. We built that because people knew exactly what the fuck they were getting in for. But if you start to understand these and you start to look at this and you start to fucking live this code every single day, 2025 can change your fucking life. So I always tell you guys, and I'm gonna leave you with this little bit of a nugget. Take a piece of rice every day. Take a piece of rice every day from this weighing scales onto this weighing scale, okay? And after a while, what will tend to happen is it will start to tip. Not gonna be instant. It's not gonna be overnight. It's not going to be, you know, in a flash. But the beauty of sales, it'll take you 12 months. But 12 months for the rest of your life is a fair fucking input. 12 months for the rest of your fucking life is a fair amount of time to give up. I've been on this entrepreneurial journey for over 10 years. I didn't really hit it until 2021. It's 2024 now, and I don't ever have to work another day in my life if I do not want to. I want you to have the skill. I want you to have the learnings. I want you to have everything that you desire. I love you. I respect you. Behave. Goodbye.